Okay, um, as I mentioned to you, this um, type of question is a part of your test on Friday. Um, when I was grading your notebook, I've seen that there's several of you that are um, getting answers wrong, so um, I decided to make a video um, to show the correct answers to this one. So, let's say, for example, this one, uh, for the first one, a pair of pauses travels towards each other at the rate of one space per second, translate and interfere these pauses to show the appearance of the rope after three seconds. Trace the actual wave, your final answer in a different color. So, again, um, the fir first thing that I am always doing is to mark the zero position. So here at this was the zero, this wave or this wave pulse is starting here, and this wave pulse is starting here. Okay, and then you will see that this one is going to the right and this one is going to the left. Okay, let's see. Um, I will make um, the left one a purple one. And they said it's um, one space per second. So if this is like if this is three seconds, it will move three spaces to the right. One, two, three. You should be copying the original wave. Do not change the wave. One last second. Just fixing right there. Okay, and then this one will be moving to the left. Let's put green. Three seconds. So that will be one, two, three spaces. And copy the original waveform. Okay, now trace your final correct answer. If there is overlap, add them. Okay, so here, if you see this one, this line, we only have purple, so the amplitude will stay there. This one, we only have purple, so the ampl amplitude will stay there. At this point, we have purple and we have um, green, but the green um, amplitude is at zero, the purple amplitude is at two. If you add this two, zero plus two will be two. And at this, um, this line, we have two for purple and one for green if we add this two it will be three and same as this one two plus one it will be three and at this point you see at this point we have green and purple at one so it means you have two ones here if you had if you add one and one it will become two and then this one will be at zero and this will be at 1 and it will be at 0 then connect the dots okay the red one will be my final answer you can leave it that way, but make sure you said that red one is your final answer, or you can erase the the original wave if you want to. Okay, next. This one, same thing. Okay, let's mark again the zero time. And this will move four seconds, okay? So one, two, three, four. And then copy the original wave. And then the other one to the left. One, two, three, four. Copy the original wave. Okay, and then add if there's overlapping. See this one, you have 0 and 0, it will be 0. At this point, you have 1 and 1 for the green and purple. If you add them together, it will be 2. At this point, you have 2 and 1, so that will be 3. Here, you have 2 and 1 also, then that will be 3. And here, you have 0 and 2, that will be 2. Here, you have... 1 and 1, 1 for the green, 1 for the purple, that will be 2, and then 0, 0, it will be 0, and connect the dots. Okay, 
So now the red one is my final waveform. And the last one, same thing. Mark the zero time. Okay. Moving to the right at four seconds. Two, three, four. Copy the original wave. Okay. Make sure you copy it correctly. Okay, next this one. Four seconds to left one, two, three, four. So I have that. Okay, then add if there's overlap. There's overlap at zero at zero. Overlap at one and one. So that will be two. Overlap at two and one for purple and green. So that will be three. This one is um, one and zero. So that will be one. And this is um, zero and negative two. Then that will be negative two. And then 1 and negative 1 will be 0. And then this one is 0, 0. It will be 0. Then connect the dots. Okay, so the red one is my final answer.